The crash site of the Cessna plane was located at a distance of 2 kilometers from the ground up to the upper part of Mount Mayon. Dr. Paul Alanis, the resident volcanologist of Mount Mayon, said that the volcano is still under alert level 2 wherein eruption may possibly happen. Even if the search and rescue operation will use chopper, it may still pose a danger. May possibility na magkaroon ng mga phreatic eruptions sa loob. Uh, and ang danger nito is baka unang una danger para sa yung sa mga search and rescue operators. And then dahil pwede magkaroon ng mga pyroclast density currents. Next is kung may aircraft na ginagamit, pwedeng mahigop yung mga debris na ito ng mga makina and magdulot ng isang aksidente pa. The crash site is a steep slope and a rockfall has also been recorded in the volcano. If a ground search and rescue operation will be conducted, there are some challenges because of the weather condition in the past days. But according to the Philippine Atmospheric, Geophysical and Astronomical Services Administration or Pagasa, improved weather condition in Bicol is expected until weekend. Sa weather, okay. Na pag-uusapan yung visibility, okay. Hindi man ganong, wala tayo nakikita malalakas na pag-ulan na magdudulot ng almost zero visibility. Fibox said that rescuers should also bring personal protective equipment including masks that could protect them from gas being emitted by the volcano. The decision to continue the search and rescue operation is now up to the local government unit. Ray Pilayo, UNTV News and Rescue, we serve the people, we give glory to God.